Now, this video series are for starting freelancers na walang idea as in zero knowledge, as in nga nga, sa kung saan nga wag magsa-start or no clue on what path to take. Luckily, our friends from HubSpot Academy prepared a digital marketing checklist to give you an overview on where to start. What's up guys, this is Vincent Julian and welcome to another episode of The White Side where we review courses, trainings, and gadgets to help you in your freelancing and content creation journey. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. And at any point of this video, I will list out all the things that I like about this training including the show notes, link articles, and specs in the YouTube description below. Before we start, if you have already decided that you want to be a social media manager or you are a social media manager, I have a video about free and paid content marketing courses that can help you in creating better strategies and content. Just click on the link on the upper right of your screen to watch the video. And let's get into part one of the fundamentals of digital marketing. The first thing that I liked about this video is it revolves around inbound marketing. Karamihan kasi ng mga negosyo ay outbound marketing o tayo yung lalapit mismo sa mga potential customers to sell our products or services. But with this short course, they will teach you how to create frameworks, better content, SEO, website optimization, and my favorite, omni-channel. Isang magandang inbound marketing strategy ay yung tinatawag natin na edutainment. This is a video marketing strategy that are meant to give value to your viewers by educating them about a certain topic, product, or services. This does not only inform your customers but it also adds credibility to you as a brand. Second thing that I liked about this course is its variety of topics. Kadalasan kasi you'll see on YouTube, TikTok, or in Google, very very niche down siya. Like they focus on social media marketing, online media buying, uh, graphic design, content marketing, at maran. Six hours later. Uh, may pang iba. Wala namang masama sa pagiging specialist. But one way to add credibility to you as a freelancer is to start as a generalist and have an idea about a lot of things and then specialize on whatever discipline speaks to you the most. Why? As a business owner, you have to understand that you will wear different hats. And same goes for your target audience. They are entrepreneurs. They are made to do everything. Of course, if pwede silang kumausap ng iisa na lang about their marketing, much better. At least that way, mas makakakuha pa sila ng mas maraming oras para sa pamilya nila. Kayo, what do you think about starting as a generalist and then ending as a specialist? Do you think it's a good move? Share your insights in the comment section para lahat tayo mabigyan natin ng different perspectives sa mga starting freelancers. Now, if this video adds any value to you as a starting freelancer or content creator, please consider subscribing, like this video, engage in the comment section, and share it with your friends. The best thing about this Fundamentals of Digital Marketing course is their resource tab. Almost every lesson, they are sharing tons of frameworks, article links, templates, slides, and of course, the Digital Marketing Strategy Checklist. According to HubSpot Academy, it may take about 2-3 to three weeks to finish the whole 15 chapters of training from inbound marketing to content strategy to SEO training, YouTube training, and many more. One pro tip, complete the fundamentals of digital marketing first before starting on the learning path. It's a 15-part series where you will learn everything there is to know about how you can start your digital marketing journey. If you want to know if each course or each section is worth watching, you may check out our playlist discussing everything there is to know about that course. 